Dean, how would you compare your stuff and just in general how you were feeling out there compared to your two previous starts? Um, I would say that I didn't have my best stuff today, but um, I really needed to compete. I mean, they put eight lefties in the lineup and the one righty. Um, but I, I, it took me a while to get my break ball going. It's a good thing I had my, my cutter to, to get me through. But it was definitely a day where I had to grind through each at bat. Joe Treza, you're up next. Go ahead, Joe. Yeah, Dean, what do you think you can learn from an outing like this? Obviously, you take something away from every outing, but you know this one was a little bit more of a grind. Yeah, well, I, I take two things. It's one that uh, I, I can I can still compete no matter what I have that day, uh, and two, I, I need to be able to make adjustments quicker. John Miola, you're up next. Go ahead, John. Dean, what have these last few? starts and weeks meant to you to, to kind of show yourself that, that you can compete at this level and you belong here? I mean, it's a, it's a great opportunity to begin with. Even this late in the season, I uh, wouldn't trade it for anything. Um, but yeah, it's, it's nice to, to get my feet under me and get my feet wet and, and um, try to compete at this level and, and see if I can stick. Joe Treza with the follow up. Go ahead, Joe. In sticking with that theme a little bit, what's it like to see Bruce be able to get a chance now in game two? Yeah, I'm, I'm so excited for him. Uh, he, I mean, he works hard. We're throwing partners during the season. So, like, wherever he goes, I'm, I go. And, and I, I'm really excited for him to, to show what he's got. Danny Grossman, you're up next. Go ahead, Danny. Not. Danny, if you still have a question, you just yeah, have to I'm unmute. Sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. Forgot to unmute. Forgot to unmute. It's past 2 a.m. here, so I pardon the the, the mistakes. Um, uh, you're getting quite a following, Dean, here in Israel, especially among the young players, the under 18 players that you you played on that team, and uh, they wanted to know what's your high and your low so far this year, and what would you advise these kids uh, who want to be the next Dean Kramer? Uh, I mean, getting called up is definitely the highest high, and I don't know that the, I, I guess quarantine would be a low because we don't get to play in front of people. And I mean, I, I guess I could consider that being a low. And 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 to the to the kids, it's it's take advantage of the guys that that you have over there mentoring. There are some good people over there, like Alon um, and Asaf, and and there's a there's a lot of a lot of good uh, mentors out there and and they should take advantage and work hard.